Hey, what's up guys, Dude Tech here. Welcome back with a brand new video. In this video, I have another cool tweaks for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. With that being said, let's get started. Hey, welcome back guys. So let's start today's video with the first week, which is gonna be camera tweak four. So the camera tweak four, well, when you download the app, it will work right away on your iPhone. But the only thing that you need to do is just to enable the bone. Let me just go to the settings here. Let's start with the settings. So all this is all what you need to do. There is no configuration. Just make sure you enable the bond here. Let's just back to the camera here, showing you guys what's going on. So it's giving you more than settings here. Most of the settings that you have, you can choose your resolution from here. Also, you can just change the camera uh, from the photo, from the focus and everything. The other thing that is gonna giving you which is that option here when you tap on it it will give you that stabilize for your pictures when you take a picture so you can check your stabilize and if it's straight or not camera tweak 4 another cool tweak that I have for you guys in today's video which is gonna be the edge giving you that bitterly and giving you that nice looking on your eye device so what the edge do for you is giving you that sub page which is you pick more of the stuff that you use on your eye device and then you can just jump to it and then you can top and then play most of the things that you always just to like you play with it or you use it like your daily basis you use all those so you can just put it here on your edge so easily when you just slide and then just tap on the one that you always you work on it and it makes it easy for you you can choose more of the stuff you can add some stuff you can add some icon you can use the contact and what the good about the edge when you just open it you can go and jump to the settings right away so this is the edge settings here once you just download the tweak you need to make sure that you enable the bond which is going to be uh, in the top here and then you have another thing which is going to be the configuration so if you want to go to the configuration you have you uh, giving you this uh, pages here so you have the ops page and then you have another page here let me just go back to the settings this is the configuration this is the pages here so this is the recent edge the op edge the taxes edge and then people edge so you can add people that you call always so you can just having an access from the edge right away and just call and then the other option which is going to be the multicolor people icon this is the beautiful edge and then this is the beautiful tweak that i highly recommend that you guys download it it's really nice and beautiful on your iDevice device edge nc pop so what nc pop do when you open your notification you see the background of the that fade there and then that motion there so this is the nc pop so once you download the tweak you need just to enable the tweak those options here which is going to be the scale percent and then you uh, have to change or you want to change the pull down percent and then you have the fade percent so as you guys can see here if I just want to play a little bit with the fade or pull down here, you guys can see it's just go far away right now. If I just bring it back again, bring it to height, just like so, it will give you that fade here, make all the pages like go and give you that fade and show your notification right into your screen and see pop. The next tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the snapper 2. So what the snapper do is just get that capture and then you can grab anything from any kind of picture that you want. Like just get some tags or something from, let me just show you guys here. So if I jump to the my notes here and I try to get like some picture of that just text that I have here in the bottom so I can just like normally hold my power bond and then or apply my home bond as well uh, will give you that fade here so all what you need to do just tap and hold and then you can get the text that you want just like so for example and after that what you need to do just double tap on it it will giving you three options those options is going to be show up once you just move the text that you want so the first one if you want to delete it or you want to just save that on your studio or other options or more so 
if I want to delete it, just like so, put it there, it'll just disappear and go. So if we go to the settings here, this is the settings, so it will be work right away on your iDevice, but you need to make sure to go to the activation, which is the first one here. So basically, always you just hold your power button, apply with home button to take a picture, but you need to make sure just to go to home plus power here, tap on it, you need to put it on the normal mode, not the screenshot. You need to just put it on no, a normal mode here, it will give you that. So when you press, there you go, giving you that feed here. That means you can just grab right now the text or the something that you're just looking for it. And then you can just save it right away on your device. Snapper 2. The next tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the unlock sound. It will give you back in the day when you open your iDevice, when you open an iPhone, it will give you that sound there. Just like so. So, unlock sound giving you that sound. This is the default sound and it's going to give you more than sound. All those sounds here. So, you can choose your unlock sound from here. Go back. You can taste that. Or you can just go pick one of these here, test. Or you can go back and pick one of the alarm. Let me just check the alarm here. Test that. Okay, so this is the unlock sound. So when you download the tweak, what you need to do, just enable bond here. And then you can choose your sound effect for your unlock device. So I'm going to be put it here right now on my default, which is going to be this one. Go back, give it a test like this. And then the other option, which is going to be the custom volume. So you can just enable that and then play with the volume. So if you go back right now, let me just close my device. When you want to open it, it will be like this. Giving you that old and classic sound for your unlock eye device. Unlock sound. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you like the video, please just like always give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe for my channel for more videos. I see you guys in the next video. This is Do Tech. Thanks for watching.